What's up everybody, my name is Nick Ford. Thanks for checking out the video and the channel. Today you're gonna get to see some of my back workout and specifically a lot of my deadlift movement. What That was what I started off with. I normally build up 135, 225, 315 and I stuck in that range today. I was really trying to work on my pull speed because right now I'm pulling at about two seconds to get it up, which is really slow if you ask me. So I'm working on getting that activation. You see me straightening my legs trying to get that drive some um, extra movement before we get um, really to the pull section. I might switch back to overhand grip completely from an over under just to see how it helps me out. But um, it's just my compound movement for the day. I worked on sets of three to five. Um, had to throw the belt on there just because uh, I was feeling kind of weak. After this, we went to pull-ups and I did uh, four sets of 10, really focused on just stretching out the lats, getting them good and warmed up for the day i like to really um, focus lats um the different angles really i don't focus too much on weights occasionally you'll see me with there with a 20 or 25 uh, pound dumbbell between my legs but most of the time i'd rather just really get a nice good squeeze get some good reps stretch them out and move on to a like a heavier exercise like a lat pull down that you'll see in a second after this went to seated cable rows right here where we um kind of went a little bit heavier focused on the squeeze but at the same time you're not going to see me really rocking you're going to see a slight sway but i'm not heaving it i'm still keeping my back my rear um delts my scapula everything is staying engaged with this movement after this we went to neutral grip pull down which is my favorite version of a pull down exercise because it allows me to really keep nice tight strict form as well as work on that um lat thickness versus the pull up lat width my favorite exercise if you haven't done it before give it a shot after this move to one arm rows with the dumbbells i'm working on keeping my back flat because you can kind of see right here that i'm flat ish but my back is still on a slight bit of an angle make sure you're pulling the dumbbell to your belt not to your shoulder because you want to engage that lower portion of your lat as well hit lat after lat pull downs, we went straight into biceps and we started with the standing barbell curl. This is my favorite movement because I can go the heaviest with it. You're not going to see me um, heaving it around. I'm trying to keep my form pretty strict, keep my shoulders back. Same with the hammer curls that you're seeing now. I really, really like to get a little bit of a sway just to feel the body language of the weights as I'm moving them. But you're not going to see me throwing my back around and grunting and just heaving weights really trying to keep nice strict form to work on that peak that's why i love these um one arm curls over the bench just because i can squeeze it focus visualize that peak like what arnold was talking about thanks for watching the video guys i really appreciate it add me on social media and until next time i will see you guys later see you